Because I'm shiny. I knew that's what you were going to sing. I think he's out of stock. What? Let's go get something to eat because I'm getting hungry. <laughs> Hey, Limbo! It's literally everything but the kitchen sink. Oh my god! <laughs> it's another day, it's another vlog, we're doing it all again. Another carpentry day. The plumbing guys are here, they're really sweet. And there's a lot of plumbing work to be done because we jigged <laughs> into different areas. I don't know, but we'll go and have a look later when they finish, I think. I have had another fall. This is your daily reminder to put your brakes on, folks. I think, oh, I don't need the brakes on, it'll be fine. And it's like, whoosh, off it goes and I'm on the floor. I don't know what exciting things are gonna happen in this vlog, hopefully nothing major. <laughs> and if it is exciting, it's all good exciting. But, but what I do plan to do, is show you how I'm doing the washing. Um, luckily, I can go over to my mum and dad's place to do the washing. It wasn't for my little DB, it would be so hard and she's just been an absolute star. So hopefully I can show you how she's been helping me. Get the units back to the wall. Right. And your dishwasher. Mm -hmm. There's a flat back. So nothing will fit against the flat back. So you've got to go out of the wall. I'm a lot. You've got to walk all the way, there's a hell. Don't take photos of the mess. You're not going to put this on your Instagram later, are you? <laughs> oh, so, sat down now. I'm just waiting for the Seanaroo delivery. Hopefully he's come back with something nice because actually I am starving and here he is. What's he got? Ooh, Obviously got, got a bag. Goodies. <laughs> Healthy goodies. Healthy? Yeah, good. He's oh. What? Hot cross buns. Ooh. Sweet and crunchy salad, Italian pasta, spinach salad, mac cheese, Ooh. Moroccan style couscous, vegetable couscous, and a salmon fillet. Oh, random, but thanks. <laughs> salmon fillets to go with the couscous. Oh, nice. You can just cook it in the microwave, it'll cook. Hard work, it's hard work. Oh, that was expensive, man. So much more expensive buying like this. How much was that? Yeah, so it was 22 quid for this, and there's probably, what, two meals there? Of salad, Jim. Mm -hmm. There you go, in like that. Next time, <laughs> the bill has come. Put the pen behind your ear. Yeah. All right, boys, let's go. So I've got the day off today, so I can help out. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God! Look at this. Look, it's taking shape. Oh, I'm stuck. This looks professional, doesn't it? So that's about one point eight. Look at me, looking all official. When it comes to there. What do you think? It's really starting to take shape. I can visualize a lot better. You just interrupted my monologue. Sorry, man. I feel it really beginning to visualize where everything is going to go and like the plans are really, really taking shape. But yeah, look. look. This is where my lowered um, worktop is going to be. What Sean is doing um, is working out where to put the tumble dryer and the washing machine. Put some boxes there. Workout. Can't wait till the boys see this. I want them to be proud of me. It's not as big as I thought. Six hundred, because they're about six hundred deep. Mm. There's plenty because we had yeah. the tumble dryer in here, and yeah. I can I can do a whole three sixty and everything. Yeah. But yeah, there's going to be plenty of room for me to turn around, and yeah, I think it looks it's going to look really good, isn't it? This is our utility room. That's where it's going to be. Ah. Excuse you, Jeff. <laughs> You haven't even had your beans yet. That's exactly how I imagined it. I really want to see this. Before we move on, I just want to mention this video's sponsor, BetterHelp. Last year, my anxiety really started to get out of control and I knew I had to do something about it. And that is when I discovered BetterHelp. BetterHelp is a professional counselling service all done online from the comfort of your own home worldwide. Signing up is so quick and easy. After answering a few questions, 
BetterHelp will match you to an available licensed therapist who best fits your objectives and preferences. There is a broad range of expertise in the BetterHelp network which may not be available locally and what I really like about the service is that you can change your therapist at any time for free. Once signed up you can make weekly video, phone or live chat sessions. Plus, you can contact your therapist at any time and you'll get a thoughtful response in a timely manner. I found BetterHelp to be a lot more affordable than traditional offline counselling, plus financial aid can be available. With everything that's going on with the home renovations at the moment, BetterHelp has been a complete godsend. My anxiety is under control, helping me to be a lot more clear and concise in my decisions decision making, preventing a very overwhelming process, getting the better of my mental health. BetterHelp wants you to start living a happier life and I know it has helped me immensely. So why not visit betterhelp.com forward slash wheels no heels for 10% off your first month. To get 10% off your first month go to betterhelp, H-E-L-P, dot com forward slash wheels no heels Still for so long took a hold of me and won't let go i've been sleeping caught me off my guard because you're in my space and now i'm so Carpentry day three today. So we are going to work out the perfect height for the lowered worktop. Of the... So that, that, that gives plenty of clearance, doesn't it? I think working height. Sean is going to be working, yeah. so we yeah, need yeah. a good sort of happy medium. Have you done one of these before? Mm, yeah. So what, what, do you have like a guide? Well, do you have any rules? We, Basically, it's tailored to the, tailored to the individual. Um, not all wheel, wheel, wheelchairs are the same. What do you think, Sean? It's about your height, isn't it? From that? <coughs> yeah, that's it. Yeah. Do you want to put it's a definitive level. mark on the oh wall? Oh my god! On dun, the dun, underside, dun, dun, dun. underside of the level. Oh god! <laughs> I have um, just popped out for some lunch, so we're going to go in now and have a look and see what they've done so far. So cool. That looks a bit high. So it's going to go down one notch, I reckon. It would be good. It's nice, smooth floor. Oh, so nice. Your dance studio. <laughs> <laughs> a little crops. mouse with clogs on. <laughs> <laughs> oh I think. Oh my God. That, that is not a has been, is it? Oh my God. I love this. How many years have you waited for this, babe? That's ridiculous, isn't it? Take that out, please. Let's go get rid of the recycling. <laughs> I think it gets shallower down the bottom. They can do it. They're the carpenters. Up above the world, looking down on creation. Not those carpenters, Sean. I think like this should be blue. I should have decorated. This should be blue, not white, inside the shelf. And I think it'll look really cool. Okay. <laughs> you just used to that. I actually, I actually said okay to something. He was so surprised. Okay. That was so funny. <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. Another thing um, that I don't know if I showed you is that we have the Neff slide and hide. Carpenter said he could do us a little drawer, a little pull out drawer to come here so that when you take stuff out of the oven, you can then put it on the tray. But quite a lot of people were saying you've then got to lean in, I don't know, and then it kind of defeats the purpose of having the slide away drawer. Part of me kind of wants it, and then part of me just can't, I just can't be dealing with it. <laughs> Some of you over on Instagram were like, yeah, I use it. All the time some of you were like no I don't use it because it gets in the way I have some important decisions to make do I want a ledge for the slide and hide oven have we ordered the right sink and I also need to order 
some cabinets for like the bespoke <laughs> unit. I'll catch up with you probably tomorrow. Morning. That was an interesting night. Um, I was up at one, I was up at four, I was up at five. <laughs> worrying about all of these um, decisions. However, I think I have come to a decision with the thanks to you amazing people over on Instagram. So I asked you whereabouts your lowered counter comes up to. Quite a lot of you were saying they were around about 800 mil. I think this is around 750. And as you can see, it comes up to kind of chest height. It sounds like quite a lot of you have it at chest height and what I have found with having it at this height is it's a good height in between height comfortable height for Sean and Daisy to go any lower it probably would be a little bit better for me I think it's a good compromise and I think the fact that I can roll over just makes it a huge difference anyway. well <laughs> we're off on an emergency trip for a sink the sink is out of stock what the sink saga continues. As you know, we're having a little bit of a sink saga. And we got the uh, bench in. Sean worked out with his genius knowledge that it's actually about a metre long, the sink. That will mean I've only got this corner to kind of work on. So we have thought that we would much rather have a smaller sink. I'm sure every project has a saga. And I think ours is going to be the sink. It smells like you spilled coffee in here. I did not spill coffee in here. Mm. My breath, coffee breath. Oh my god, it is. Um, so do you... No, I can't wait for it. Do you need the young cut? Uh, or what? The tap, I don't know. I don't need any of that. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I like them both. Which one do you like? That one. The round one? Yep. Yeah, I like that one too. Mission accomplished. I put some makeup on, I feel a bit better for it. All I have been doing this week is sitting here editing vlogs and working um, and then going downstairs and filming the progress. <laughs> but I'm going to go and pick Daisy up from school now and then we're going to head and get some food for the <laughs> you go to my head because i know i'm dealing with the devil but i'm standing yeah i think they've surpassed themselves i think they're surprised at how much they got done today or well, this week actually because everything as you saw was so flat packed but oh my god i kind of don't want to show it now <sighs> <laughs> Sean has gone off to work and it's just me and DB today, Saturday. So nice not to have anyone in the house today. Um, and Daisy and I are going to go off and get some breakfast and I'm going to finally get my very much needed coffee. Only a shadow Can I take your order today? Bacon and cheese flatbread. Yeah. 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 Daisy, what were you doing? Were you showing the cat around the kitchen? My washing has magically been returned. Thanks, Dad. And my mum, over the weekend, has been washing four loads of washing. And bless her, she has folded it all. My family have been amazing during this process. They've been inviting me over for uh, dinners and um, helped me with the washing. But you will never guess what I found today, a leak. Yeah, we could really do without this, to be honest. It's running water and I could hear that. There's the leak, the overflow. I noticed that the flat roof was wet. So Sean's got to sort that out and I'm gonna end the vlog here. Got some really exciting things coming up so make sure that you subscribe for those and I look forward to seeing you in the next one. Hopefully with not many dramas. Bye.